Hello, wonderful souls of the universe. So, I just wanted to do a video of the things I got from Disneyland. This is probably going to be a two part video because I did get something that's edible, so I kind of want to eat it now and then I'll get all the rest of the stuff together after like I do this. So, <clears throat> so I'll, I will just explain what I got and why I got it. Well, not really why I got it because obviously just Disney stuff, you kind of just want things when you go there. <laughs> um, but yeah, so if you see an outfit change or if I look a little different in the rest of the video, just know that I mainly just wanted to get this part over to it, over and done with because I have something that's edible and I don't want it to rot. <laughs> Plus my sister really wants to eat it too, so she keeps asking me and I just need to get this video over and done with. Yeah, so let me show you. Alright, so the first thing I'm going to share with you is something I kind of want to make a tradition every time I go to Disneyland. So I started this when I got my braces off two years ago now. Every time I leave, well every time we're there we go to downtown Disney before we leave. It's a little tradition we kind of made up. Um, but yeah, I've always wanted to try a caramel apple from Disneyland because they're also pretty and I heard they're really good. High in sugar. Perfect, but <laughs> yeah, so I got myself a little mini mouse caramel apple. She's so cute. Um yeah, I really love how cute it looks. I'm gonna guess that this is chocolate and her ears are marshmallow. And I kind of, I'm not excited for the sugary part and I think these are M&M's. But yeah. So, I'm gonna eat it. I'm gonna eat the little marshmallow part. So enjoy this little mukbang I have in store for you because I have this. Oh no, her ear is gone. <laughs> okay, maybe I'm just gonna eat the ear because I'm not really wanting to bite into this right now. I'm gonna use a knife because I don't trust my teeth. <laughs> it's kind of bad to say, but yeah. So when you see me next in this video, I'm probably not gonna look like this. I might have like three different outfit changes because when I went there I wanted to get a wallet but they didn't have any of the ones I wanted. I wanted a small wallet because my wallet right now is pretty big. Let me show you. So this is the wallet I have right now. It's Lounge, fry, lounge Fly lounge fry, um, Stitch. It's really cute. I got this for my birthday last year, I think. And it's a medium sized wallet. Right now they have wallets that are like this big and it's all zip, but I didn't want a big wallet. I really wanted a downgrade because being 21, when I go to all the bars, you know, they ask for your ID and I have to bring out this big thing and then shuffle through it. I mean, it has all these little nice compact compartments for your cards and a wallet space that has little pineapples in it and a coin part but whenever I put coins in here they fall out like all the time so I mean it's cute but I want half of this so I got one online because they didn't have any at, at the Disney any of the Disney stores, they only carry the big ones. So when I get that in the mail, I will share that with you here as well. It's super cute and I'm excited for it. Yeah. I will show you, see, show you guys what else I got. So I also got new ears. 
I normally don't like to buy ears every time I go there because one they're getting expensive they raise up the price on them but I'm like I'm fine and quaint with one pair of ears but last year I got Christmas ones because I thought they were super cute and I normally just wear the regular um, Minnie Mouse Minnie Mouse ears this year I forgot my ears and I was very upset about it so I don't like going throughout the park without ears so I got a new pair of ears for the simple just sequin ones I told myself I would never get these because I'm not a fan of sequin and it looks uncomfortable to wear but we honestly don't really even feel them and I love the new headbands on these because they don't squeeze my head like my old ones do. My old ones would give me headaches and I would have to take them off throughout the whole day. These ones are cute. I love the sparkliness to it. I was going to get rose gold but very simple. Okay. <laughs> Alright so starting from where I left off, I showed you the ears and the apple and my old wallet. So. Like I said, I was gonna look different because I was waiting for my other things to come in. So one of the other things I got was the spirit jersey. It's the Belle of the Bronze. It has the bronze D, which is really thick compared to the other ones. And it has a little gold detailing, bronze detailing at the bottom. Kinda looks like it's sparkly when you're wearing it. And then the bronze Disneyland in the back. Really comfy, really cute, soft, warm. Got it. I wasn't gonna get a spirit jersey because now I have six, which I'll probably do like a spirit jersey collection haul thing. But I um, wasn't gonna get one. Stayed all day, forgot a jacket. So, what do they have the op to offer? Spirit jerseys, and I got one. Alright. So. My other thing I got that I wanted to get at Disneyland but they couldn't have. This feels kind of big. I hope it's not too large, but we'll see. Unboxing. She's wearing my ears. Okay, it's it's a decently sized wallet. How much did I get this for? It's 34. I don't know. I think I got it for 34. Oh my gosh, it's that is adorable wallet. Oh, it's cute. I think it's a good size. It's literally half, maybe a little more than half of my other wallet got these pretty lotuses these lotus flowers lotus is my favorite flower and then little Mickey minis um, got rose gold detailing lounge fly obviously okay The inside. It's got the pockets for your months. And then I guess my ID will go there. Oh, it's got a cute little polka dots. And then stuff for other cards. Okay. I like it. Let me use it and then determine, but I'm gonna have to like it because bought it. It's cute. Okay, no, I like it. It's it's cute. I can't wait to rearrange all my wallet stuff in there. Alright, the last thing I got is also from Loungefly, but it's not Disney. I don't know if you guys saw, but we also went to Universal when we were there. So. I got this Harry Potter Loungefly purse. That was really cute. I like black for my bag and purses. Simple to the point. It has Hedwig with a broom and then Hogwarts and the back is just plain. I don't know 
why this looks like it says H-E, but I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be H-P for Harry Potter, but it looks like it says H-E. And then, Harry Potter now to buy. It's pretty spacious. It has handles and then a strap. I'll show you guys the inside. Pretty roomy. I can I can put a lot in here. And I plan to do that. I recently got rid of, as you guys saw from my other video, um, I got rid of a ton of purses and mini backpacks. So I was like, let's upgrade to something a little better. <laughs> my babe is just watching me. Baby, baby is so cute. But yeah, that's everything. Um, Glad I got to share this little haul with you guys. I'm glad to rearrange this. Woo. Thank you guys so much for watching. And with that being said, I will see you guys in the next video. Live by the sun, love by the moon, and I'll see you soon. Bye!